Hi, my name is David Eldridge, and this is my Raspberry Pi extra credit project for CPEG 202. Right now, I have the Raspberry Pi to be set up as a medium center running Rasp BMC. It has the HDMI output, the Ethernet cable to get the internet, so I can run some of the features on the uh, Rasp BMC. And also, I have a USB hub connected with two USBs to hold movie files and an the uh, USB adapter for the wireless keyboard. So let's turn it on and give it a shot. Here it comes on. Now it's just booting up. Here we are. So if I come over to my wireless keyboard. Give it a second to load. Okay, now we have the Raspberry BMC Media Center up on the TV with the Raspberry Pi and I can just use the wireless keyboard here with the uh, it's got a little mouse on the right so it makes it nice if you want to sit on the couch and use it um, you can come over here there's a you hook it up to the, if you uh, choose to hook up to the internet you can get the local weather you can put pictures on it to show your friends and family but uh, right now I'm going to go into videos okay now if you look up here you can see files. Now this is where those two USBs are going to come in handy. Um, click on into the first one. Right now I have a uh, Batman Begins loaded onto one flash drive so you just click on that and start watching that. Right there shows your title, gives you all the options here. Fast forward a little bit so you can see the picture quality, although it's not going to be too great because uh, this file itself is not in uh, high definition. Alright, skip out of this one. Then you can also go back here to the other flash drive. So if you had an extensive movie library and you had a you can use the external hard drive big flash drive and other large SD card I just have it split because I don't have a very big any of them uh, you can just keep this all tucked behind a TV at your house and it'd be a very nice media center here's Zombieland this is actually in 1080p so you'll be able to see the how well the Raspberry Pi does with the resolution it does a pretty good job Alright, then I'm going to exit out of here. And then, on top of just using hard copies, it's pretty neat. The Raspberry Pi actually gives you the option to use these things called video add-ons, similar to apps. Um, here I have Watch ESPN. So if you click on that, it, it uh, allows you to live stream with the ESPN 720 uh, HD videos.
Alright, now watch ESPN is up, and you can scroll through all the uh, current videos they have up. Right now, I'll just pick one that has to do with the NBA Finals. And it's going to open up the stream. Buffering. Right. Now we have ESPN streaming to the TV through the Raspberry Pi. Okay, for time's sake, I'm going to exit out of that. And then, on top of just ESPN, you can also stream YouTube videos, as well as tons more if you uh, decide to download the add-on. And that's about it. Um, you can do pretty much anything you want to do with this media center. You can put videos, movies, music, pictures. Like I said, you can pull up the weather. It's pretty versatile. There's the weather for Newark right now. Like I said, that's about it. I had fun uh, messing around with this little thing. and Pretty neat. When I go home, I can set this up to my big TV in the living room and put all my movies on it. Like I said, this was my CPEG 202 project. And thank you.